tonight. <laughs> um, so the first thing I realized in 1972 at 19 years of age when I emigrated to Ottawa, I had only seen a manual typewriter. I would call home and it would be a dollar a minute and I'd earn two dollars and twenty cents an hour working for Bell Canada. And my mother would just talk and talk and talk. <laughs> and the third was that if I wanted any information, I had to go to the library and I had a library card. Now, many in the room may not understand this, but I think there's a few who might kind of nod heads on this. So what I said was, what has happened after AI? Now, I talk about AI as a creature of inquiry. I worked with the Department of Agriculture we call artificial insemination, <laughs> uh, artificial intelligence, but this is a new phrase that I came across which was called after internet. And Joey Ito, who is the director for MIT Media Lab, talks about the dramatic change that that has happened. So if you look at it, instead of a typewriter, what I have is I have a tablet. And instead of the telephone, I did an, a 75 or 90 minute Skype call with video for free across the world. And instead of the library card, I had the Google search. People kind of recognize this, kind of familiar, 40 years, how much it's all changed. And so, what happened here? Okay. I, sorry, I, this morning at about 